Hey, I'm Sean Smith of the Marine Industry Association of South Florida, and this is Salty Jobs. Today we're going to be visiting one of our marine industry companies, so uh, follow me. Hey everyone, we're here today at Ward's Marine Electric and these guys really cover all your marine electric needs from parts, service, installation, panel production, basically the same way your electric is set up in your house, these guys mirror on a boat. So what we're going to do today is we're going to be in the shop working with some shore cords and then a little bit later we're going to be going to one of the local yards and doing some panel work on one of their client vessels. So I'm here today with Steve, who is the Inside Service Manager at Ward's Marine Electric. Steve, could you explain to me how you got in the industry? I actually grew up in the industry. Uh, I grew up in the Bahamas as a, as a young man. My father was a, a, an architect, but uh, we decided to, to get into the dive business. So I've always loved to be out in the water. I love boating. So I took it the next step. You know, I decided the marine industry is where I wanted to be. I got my ABYC certification, and here I am. Uh, with boards. I've been here over 30 years now. So the ABYC certification, that's the required training to be a marine electrician? Here at Ward's Marine Electric, that's correct. Fantastic. So um, what are we going to be doing here in the shop today? We're going to build an adapter that's used on a 70 foot to 80 foot boat, allowing them to plug into 250 amp receptacles and give them 100 amps worth of power. Fantastic. Well, let's yeah. get started. The team at Ward started by assembling the enclosures for the shore cords. While they were working on that, Steve taught me how to assemble them by installing the cables through the cable glands in the enclosure where all final connections are made. From there, it's off to the testing bench to confirm the control is working and the phasing is correct. Before heading to the vessel, we stopped in the warehouse for supplies and a quick wardrobe change. So we're here with Luis, who is the Fort Lauderdale Service Manager for Ward's Marine Electric. Luis, what's your background? How'd you get into doing this? Well, I went to school for uh, engineering, electrical engineering, uh, electronics and computer. And um, I am ABYC certified. How long have you been working for Ward's? Uh, 20 years. Very cool. So I see right here next to us is the switchboard. Well, the switchboard is basically the brain of the boat. Every component, every system on the boat is controlled and mainly the power sources are controlled by the switchboard. Uh, we are doing a, a refit of the uh, switchboard. We're basically upgrading uh, the uh, automation system. So we're gonna install uh, three generators and a short power breaker. First, we looked at the blueprints to see where each cord matched up with its corresponding number on the switchboard. Next, it was time to install the generator circuit breakers, which, surprisingly, was much easier than I had expected. At the end of this salty job, the switchboard refit is almost complete. Hey, thanks for being here with us today, guys. Join us next time on Salty Jobs. 